So I've been gone for a minute and I would like to say that I'm sorry. <laughs> but I'm not, you know what I'm saying? Because sometimes you just gotta have fun. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes, you know, or maybe very few times in our lives, we find something that is meditative in nature and kind of enhances and brings a little bit more value to our lives. We have been in a matter of under a month, 120 some odd miles on this guy right here, on that guy right there. And I'll say this, walking sucks, driving, I hate it. Running, not going to do it. Riding a bike, don't want to do it, got no interest. But you put me on this thing, and I can ride all day. So if you've been on the, on the fence about a one wheel, and you've been going back and forth, don't be. Your only regret will be that you didn't do it. Big shouts out to Future Motion. Go to onewheel.com and pick you one up. Check it out. This is me in Denver opening the one wheel pint, and at the end, you'll get our first ride. Rest in peace, Mo3. How you feel about Mo3? He's good. Wake up when you talk. Yeah, he's good. Oh, he's 10 Turk Tech, your boy Chuck checking in with you. How do you do good people? You and you and all of you. We got a very special guest in the house today, my son. Denver. Everybody say hi to Denver. Hi, Denver. Hey, man. So, what are we doing today? We are unboxing the one wheel and its accessories. The who? The one wheel. What the hell is a one wheel? It's like a hoverboard with like one uh, wheel. Hoverboard? You're gonna fly. Yeah, it goes really fast. Just shoot your eye. Yeah. We're gonna talk about you know the reasons why we went with the pint instead of the XR. You know everybody's gonna say cost. That really wasn't it. We both. You go to school and I go to work less than you know two miles from the house. So that was it. We're not going to hit you with the Casey Neistat. I promise you, we're not going to hit you with that. You know who Casey Neistat is? I don't know who Casey Neistat is. That's not a box as big, and you signed for it, right? Mm -hmm. Was it heavy? Yes. About 25, 30 pounds. Yeah. yeah. We got our little unboxing knife. We'll open it, we'll show it to him, and then we'll open the accessory. Then uh, maybe we'll take a break and put the accessories on. Yeah. And then show them the board after. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. It's upside down. <laughs> Man, don't cut yourself. I'm not. You know that knife will be yours when I'm uh, once I transform. What's when you transform? Like a butterfly. You wanna be a butterfly? Uh, you know what? Before we get into that, I think one of my biggest reasons. Like, and you know this, I, I'm really, meditation is my thing, especially what I've learned about active meditation. Active meditation is when you're doing a, uh, a specific task and you're focused. You, you can do it just strictly off muscle memory. You don't really have to think about it, like washing dishes or washing clothes. And I use those times to meditate. So I figure what would be... Everybody always talks about the corner pieces that you get with the pint. And they say we have to keep our uh, all of the packing materials in case we got to send it back or ship it somewhere. Oops. There we go. What is that? So what do you have to say about the packaging? The packaging is clean, almost like an iPhone. Now, for those of you not hit, the one wheel is... A PEV, mm -hmm. personal electric vehicle, right? Okay. Yeah. Oh shit! More awesome. What does it say, Denver? Life is about to get more awesome. Now, that's a tough plane because our lives are already pretty awesome. Yeah. <laughs> Now it's got a bunch of packing dust on it. This is dirty. Oh. <laughs> oh man, get out of here. It, it's rather dusty. Yeah. It's kind of dusty and nasty. You wanna pull it out? Yeah. Here. There you go. No, it's fine. There you go. And in the box. Ah, the one wheel. 
Whoa. We waited quite some time for this. And wow. Yes. That <laughs> is what we were waiting for. Is a woman. <laughs> Skirt. Hmm? Skirt. So in the box, you get the one wheel with the go-kart wheel. All of your normal books and shit. Stickers. Stickers, everybody knows. I love stickers, pint, yeah, 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 yeah. one wheel, whatever. Uh, we're already there. So in the box, you do get a charger, and that was one of my big questions when I was looking to order one of these, because it doesn't say that you get a charger. It doesn't, you know what I'm saying? It doesn't say that. But if you buy the ultimate pack, you get uh, the fast charger. So I think this charges the pint in two and a half hours. So our one wheel isn't gonna look like this for a, a bunch of time. Man, that shit's dirty as hell. Kyle, Kyle, come on with the dust, bro. No, we love you, we love you. And this is a big shout out to all, to, to all of the American companies. This is an American made product. This is not a cheap Chinese knockoff. This is made in the Santa Cruz. California. Made in the USA, it's up there with Simrel, Dynavat, you know what I'm saying? I would put this, and that's why it's on the show. So what do you think about it, you know, fresh out the box? It has a handle. It does have a handle. But we got some future motion cards. That's what's up. Nice catch. <laughs> now, we've talked about this for quite some time. Now, scale of 1 to 10, how difficult do you think it is going to be for us to ride. Do you remember when you were little when we got the first hoverboard? You were like 10? Yeah. Who was the first one to ride it? I think it was you. Yep. Yeah. You and got it quick. It's funny because anytime I look at something like this, I already know if I could do it before I even do it. Mm -hmm. You think you could do this? Yeah. No problem. No problem? Yeah, no problem. I can't wait to The learning fall. curve. What? <laughs> You can't wait to fall. Nah, you're not gonna fall. I'm not gonna fall. So, just taking it out of the box, I mean, this, the quality. It's heavy. It's like an iPhone. And I say that because you shake it, there's no rattle, there's no movement. When I buy something, I, generally, I don't know why, but I fucking shake it. If I shake it and I hear a rattle, I, usually I wanna take it back. Mm -hmm. But, um, big shouts out to Kyle over at One Wheel. I guess he's the inventor of the one wheel and he invented it to destroy boredom. Mm -hmm. So no longer will we be bored. So I think this is ill, the way that it knows. That's the back, that's the front. Mm -hmm. Did you know that? Yeah. Okay. That's not all folks. Yes. Now a lot, of, a lot of you who have been looking at the one wheel, if you have been looking at the one wheel, you can just buy the one wheel by itself. You can get, uh, there's a couple, there's like three level bundles, one where you get a uh, just a fender which goes over the wheel because the wheel, I don't know if you see that, is exposed. It kicks up mud and dirt and it gets your dirt clothes all dirty. And we spent a couple dollars for our clothes so we're not gonna have that. <laughs> it works. When you buy your one wheel, you do not have to buy all of the accessories. The one wheel by itself, I think, is nine fifty. The nine fifty plus tax. And then if you get the ultimate bundle, the real reason I got the ultimate bundle is because on the site they allow you to uh, modify it, and you can see what your board will look like. Did you know I was a skater as a kid? I did not. I believe you, because I haven't skated in a while. That's the Ron Bergen Defender. Another handle. An additional mag handle just because it came with kit. You know what those are? Stickers? No. What kind of? The rail bars. They go on this portion right here. So yeah, we do have a fast charger. Where'd the other charger? Oh no. When you buy the ultimate kit, you do get the the ultra charger. Supposedly it charges it in 50 minutes instead of two hours or whatever it is. And it is a little bit bigger than, that's the charger that came with it. Two hours, two and a half hours, three hours, whatever it is. 50 minutes right there. So, you know, you throw that in the backpack. So when you on the move, you can charge real quick. Sometimes you gotta be. In and out. Yeah, you already know. He already knows. So yeah, we do have the, uh, 
The Ron Bergen Defenders. Yeah, these are dope. That is dope. We should pause this. We're gonna add our Gucci Man LaFleur. And then give him a picture of that. And then we'll go downstairs and... Gucci Man LaFleur. Yeah, Gucci, ain't that his name? We about to have that, uh, that Sue Whoop board. Sauce Walker would approve of this board afterwards. <laughs> One Wheel's a dope company. You never heard of this company before, and I'm just showing you this. What do you think? What do you think of the company? How do you feel about it? I think it's nice, but I also think its name is Pint, and I thought it would be, like, tiny, but, like, it's a good size still. But we haven't seen an XR in person either. Yeah. So the XR is, like, that much longer. That's it's long. wider. The, the foot pads are different. But this is fine. This is, like, uh, this is the size of the skateboard that I rode when I was a kid. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm fine with that. Mr. Denver. Yes. How difficult was that? That's our one wheel. Uh, about 35 minutes difficult. Ron Burgundy and Red. So would you say one to ten? How 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 you how soon how quick do you think we're gonna get the hang of this? This is crazy. What would ten be? Or a ten three. would be your natural. Oh, okay, so a seven. What okay. about you? I'm about a nine. You think I so? think I'll be carving tomorrow. Yeah, I think I'll be carving turkeys tomorrow. I think I'm ready to send it. We put the, the accessories on, right? Mm -hmm. Wasn't that hard, was it? No, it wasn't. That fast charger charges pretty quick. Yeah, it's like already at like 75. Yeah. Ron Burgundy and Red. But I think the cool part about this is that, like I said, if we, when we wind up getting an XR, and you get this one, you can get any color, you can make it your own. Mm-hmm. You know, uh, Everything. Yep. You ready to shred? Yes. <laughs> we'll see y'all outside for the uh, maiden voyage. Uh, one wheel. We're going to come back. We're going to do all that crazy stuff like range tests and uh, off-roading and all of that shit. We plan on doing all of it. So uh, get used to us. Peace. I'll meet you downstairs. Yeah, that's it.